Welcome to the LexisNexis News Desk iLearning module on sharing articles via alerts, newsletters and RSS. Within LexisNexis News Desk there are many distribution tools at your disposal to share copyright compliant news and information with colleagues and clients, create branded newsletters, dynamic graphs or simply share email alerts or RSS feeds providing business critical information across your organisation and beyond. When you are monitoring the news, there are times when the article you are reading or the graph you have created will be extremely useful to others in your organisation. There are several ways of sharing such insights by using alerts, newsletters and charts. The first is simple email. When you are reviewing your search results, you may choose to select a few articles and email them together via the email option at the top of the screen, or email them individually from beneath each article. The same applies when viewing a graph. Sending an email is never more than a click away. Alternatively, if the search is to be continuously useful, you can set up an automated alert, either for your personal use or to share articles. This is done via the Share tab at the top of the page. Select Create an Alert via the blue button on the top right hand side of the screen and the work page will refresh to provide an alert wizard to complete. Enter the alert name, your recipient's email address, remember to separate multiple email addresses with commas or semicolons, and email subject. Next. Drag and drop the searches or charts that you'd like to include, then add recipients, subject line and layout style. Finally, from the last drop down menu, select the update schedule when you wish to receive an update to your inbox. For example, I would like to receive an update on the Winter Olympics daily at 11am. Once created, Save and select the back option at the top left hand side of the page to return to your alert dashboard. From the dashboard, you can choose to delete and pause updates or click on the alert name to edit. In addition to email updates, you may need to change the look and feel of the alert or editorial control such as delivery time and article selection. This is when you may choose to create and distribute branded newsletters to keep your organisation informed of relevant industry and company news instead of a basic alert. Use the newsletter feature to create custom newsletter emails with selected articles and saved searches. Newsletters can be sent on an ad hoc basis or scheduled to send automatically at selected times. At any time you can edit, pause, update recipients, reschedule and delete your newsletters. You can also send a test newsletter to your own email address to preview what the recipients will see. Newsletters are also located in the share tab from the top of the page. Select the blue newsletter button or edit a pre-created newsletter on the page. To customise the branding of your newsletter, select the Edit Newsletter button on the top right hand side of the page. Within the newsletter template, you can also select the email format, layout and apply headers and footers such as introductory text or a banner logo. Return to the newsletter setup by saving and selecting the back button on the left. Complete the settings as before with the email alert. At the bottom of the newsletter creation wizard, you have an additional option to edit and send. Click edit and send to manually send the newsletter. This also allows you to editorially preview and edit the contents of the newsletter before sending. For example, you can update the introductory text, add commentary to the articles, add a logo and make any final styling adjustments. When you are ready to deliver to the recipients, click send. This is for plain HTML. For enhanced HTML, these amendments can be done in the template. To test the email, to check the styling and contents as they would appear in your inbox, click send test email. This will send a test email to the email address you use to log in with, no matter of the recipients listed on the page. 
When you schedule a newsletter, it will automatically send new stories that have appeared in your saved searches since the previous newsletter went out. If no news stories have appeared in a saved search, then that particular section on the newsletter will be empty. If none of the applied saved searches has new articles since the last send, the newsletter will not be sent. The final delivery and share method available with LexisNexis Newsdesk is the ability to share via RSS and HTML feeds. Select the search you wish to export in your content pane and click the menu to the right to export feed. Your feed will instantly be added to your export tab. Within your export page, you can export saved searches in a variety of formats including RSS and Atom feeds and HTML links. Exporting feeds this way makes it easy to integrate and show the headlines outside of the service. For example, on a company intranet and in software such as SharePoint. This concludes the iLearning sharing articles from LexisNexis Newsdesk. However, if you would like to speak to someone for further assistance, please contact the help desk number from your sign-in page or visit the help files at the top right-hand side of the screen.